Hi there fellow developers, my name is Harshit and in this video I am going to show you how to actually contribute to an open source project whether you are under GSSOC, SOC or any organization. In this video I am going to show you how to actually make a contribution to an open source project. So let's begin. So the very first step of making an open source contribution is to select a project that matches your tech stack. For example, if you're very good with HTML, CSS and JavaScript, then you're, you're going to pick up a project that matches your tech stack that includes HTML, CSS and JavaScript. For me, it's Python. My tech stack is Python. So I'm going to pick up a project that matches my tech stack, which is this one, pen testing and hacking scripts. So I'm going to fork this repository first. So you have to fork this repository first. Alright, but I have forked this repository already. So I'm going to open it. After opening this repository that you have forked in your in your account, you have to click on this code, select HTTPS, then you have to copy this link. Then you have to go to your local machine, create a folder on desktop or whatever or where you want. Then uh, press Ctrl Shift and right click of your mouse, open terminal here, write CMD, clean, color A so that you can watch it properly now i am going to increase its size now write git clone paste the link by doing this we are going to get uh, all this code to our local machine in this folder so let's see as you can see it's completed we have uh, all this code and all that folders in our local machine now now we can make changes and uh, start contributing so before that we have to look for good first issues so open the main repository then click on the issues click on the issues tab look for the issues that uh, you think you can work on uh, if you don't found any you can uh, create your own new issue uh, also make sure to check out that uh, the issue you are choosing to work on is not assigned to someone. For example, these are the issues that are not assigned to anyone yet. So you can work on these issues. And uh, if you look at this one, script addition, crossfire, poc.py, this issue is assigned to some person. As you can see here, if you figure out an issue that uh, you think you can solve in this repository, then click on that issue and uh, just comment down here the name of the repository owner the username of the repository owner and write kindly assign this issue to me just like this now it is the choice of the owner uh, whether he wants to assign this issue to you or to someone else i'm going to show you how to actually create an issue so for that you have to click on this issue tab then uh, then you have to click on new issue then uh, select the category of your issue like uh, did you figure out a bug in the code or did you have any feature request or you want to actually uh, add your own script in this repository so i'm going to select the issue third i'm going to add a script in this repository then i have to fill this template so this is the script that i'm going to add in this repository i have write already about this so i'm going to select the title of this what is the aim of this repository? I am going to first fill the detail here. Then uh, I have to select this yes like this uh, backspace and X. Now I have to write about the aim. What is the objective of this repository? This objective of this repository is to convert uh, the script provides a functionality for encrypting text using that's it now we are going to submit our issue make sure to check everything again make sure to recheck everything again the script provides functionality for encrypting text using various and things like that in detail i have explained this yes uh, yes make sure to write here uh, kindly assign this Kindly mark this under GSSOC 23. 
make it bold so that the owner can see it clearly after that just submit your new issue so after submitting an issue you are going to get a unique number make sure to copy this number and uh, paste it here we are going to use this number when we are we are going to use this number when we are making our pull request so till now we have created so till now we have created our issue now we are going to make a pull request so before that i have to add my code in this repository so i'm going on my local machine i am going on my projects this is the code that i am going to add in this repository paste it here open terminal here i'm going to open terminal okay it's open already directory i have to get into this directory after that write git status to check the untracked files so these are the untracked files i am going to add these files git add dot so i have added all the files now i am going to check again git status git status okay let me check my branch git branch master i have to create a new branch git branch encryption text now i have to switch to this branch git checkout encryption text all right now i have to check git status so these are the new files that i have uh, added in this now i am going to make a commit these are the files that i have added now i have to make a commit in this git commit minus s you can ignore minus s and you can just directly use minus m and write your message adding add encryption text encryption script we are writing this message so that uh, the owner can understand in, in short that uh, what commit we are what changes we are making in this repository so we are going to hit enter est after this you can see we have clearly we have uh, made our commit now we can we have you can see we have clearly made a commit now we are going to check it again get status nothing to commit which means it's done now now we are going to push this git push origin branch name my branch name is encryption text now i have pushed my code to my uh, repository now i am going to make a pull request so i am going to press control and opening i am going i am pressing control and opening the link from here so when you press control and open the link this link then you are going to land up here now you have to write how what uh, what now you have to write about this pull request what this pull request is doing which issue this pull request is solving and all that stuff so you have to fill all this so the very first and most important thing you have to write is this uh, pr resolves and uh, the code and the number that we got while uh, we are ma we made our issue we are going to copy this number and going to paste it here and i am going to paste it here this pr resolves uh, issue number Hashtag two four two 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 twenty four. Adding encryption script. Now fill this template. You have to select all this based on that. You have to like I am doing this. I have select. Now you have to fill this template. I am writing 
mm, remove unnecessary things for example remove this remove this type of change that are not relevant okay remove all this checklist make sure to check this my code follows remove this yes i have reviewed my own code press x select this so you are you are making a selection by pressing x in this bracket all right so i have commented my code yes i have done this x i have added no i have not done this i have created uh, okay so i have to add my code in this so press x again yes i have done this i have created a helpful and easy to understand readme.md yes i have created this yes i have created this so i am going to select this too remove this unnecessary lines no new warnings remove this i have added no i haven't remove this and in the end just write kindly mark this contribution under gss oc 23 kindly mark this contribution under gssoc 23 now create your pull request as you can see this is the code that i am adding in this repository and i am going to create my pull request so when you create on the uh, pull request link it's going to take time to make some checks whether it's following some guidelines and all that stuff so after making this all check it's going to turn green and uh, yeah pull request is linked with that issue that we have created as you can see here development successfully merging this pull request may close this issue my pull request is actually linked with that issue that we have created so that's how this actually works so you created an issue if the issue is assigned to you then you are going to create a pull request and in that pull request we have to add the issue number as you can see the issue i created is uh, is at number 224 in pull request i write the same i write the same number here to link my pull request with that issue so that uh, the owner of this repository can understand that uh, this uh, pull request is linked with linked with uh, that issue linked with that issue that we have just created so congrats you just learned how to create a new issue and how to create a pull request so after making a pull request you are all good to go the rest is now at uh, the owner of this repository uh, he will decide whether he wants to merge my pull request in his repository or not so that's how you create a pull request and that's how you create a new issue and how you and that's how you link that issue with your pull request i hope you learned something new here if you face any error or come across any problem or any conflict feel free to reach out to me you can comment down below any issues i am here to help you out